Well, the high school football playoffs are here and the action continued today. Our Brandon Schaff was out in Freer to cover six man football and for Incarnate Word Academy, it was an historic moment. I'm here in Freer at Buckaroo Stadium for the Incarnate Word Academy Angels first ever playoff game. It's the first season for their six man football team and it all culminates right here. You've seen the progression, you know, from the uh, hot summer scrimmages to where we are now in the playoffs. It's really come together little by little and they're playing as a team and it's been great to watch. Luciano was one of the IWA fans who braved the rain and the cold, traveling to Freer to support his son Damian. The sophomore running back scored the first points of the game for the Angels after taking off with room to run. Damien said fans making the trip to cheer them on propelled the team to victory. It just gives us like a little extra boost of energy and it just helps us and without them we wouldn't have won today. Luciano said IWA's first season has been a historical year. Damian was one of many Angels to score a touchdown on Saturday. After putting up more than 50 points, Damian explained what led to the team's dominant performance. We came together as a team, we played as a team, and we executed, and it was really good. The Angels would go on to defeat the St. Augustine Knights 51-14. to IWA head coach Jay Aleman said his team is writing history as the season progresses. Every win we get is a historic moment for the program, for the community, for the school, and so just to get that win, to notch our ticket to the next round, it, it's just awesome. Next up for IWA is the Emory Weiner Jaguars. They will play at 2 p.m. next Saturday in Edna. But before that, it was time for the Angels to celebrate with their coach. Go Angels! Brandon Schaff, 3 News.